There is a 10 mile stretch of road in New Jersey that has gained notoriety over the years. Legends of murders, hauntings, the occult, and of the paranormal surround the area. It is considered one of the most haunted places in the United States. Michael! Michael. <laughs> oh my gosh, we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. This, this is the is dream. dream. <sighs> yes. <laughs> oh. Everything's beautiful here. Look at this. Oh, it's, it's, it's literally like, like fake. fake. Isn't that crazy? Oh my gosh, so beautiful. So beautiful. So beautiful. <laughs> Michael! Michael. <laughs> Hi, this is Michael. Leave a message. Hey, Michael. It's um, Isabella. I just wanted to say hi. I, I know it's been almost a year now um, since everything that happened with Jess, and I, I just want to see how you're doing. Um, I heard you're, you're dating someone new, and I think that's great. I'd love to meet her. Um, and I, I'd also like to talk to you because I think that I have a way that maybe you and I can finally find some closure. So um, let's try to meet up in the city maybe this Saturday. Uh, let me know what you think. Talk to you soon.
Hey, good evening, uh, Mr. Schwartz. And this is my stunning wife. Yep, see right here, RJ's VIPs. Thank you, have a good evening. Michael, what's up, baby? Long time. The renovations look fantastic. Yeah, it took us a while, but we got it done. Call. Michael, nice to meet you. Yeah. Shit, RJ. RJ, this is Kayla. Kayla, this is RJ, an old time friend, also the owner. Pleasure to meet you. This is so dope. Dope, dope, dope. That's exactly what we're looking for. You know what I'm saying? We have the dopest booth in the whole club waiting on you guys right in the back. Yeah, let me uh, show you the way. Uh, yeah. That's a temporary part. Renovations went a little bit over budget. It was very temporary. And you better go check your girl. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah. Don't lose sight of that, dude. Good How are you? Good yeah, so you're on RJ's list. Mike, Vinny, and Tony. Check the VIP for us, please. RJ, do you know somebody named Ty? <laughs> if he's not on the list, he can't get in. Hey, Paisan. Carl. <laughs> hey. My man. What's up, Ty? Place looks. Don't say dope. What? This. Don't say dope. What's the occasion? I don't know. Michael said he wanted to go out. That he had something important to run by me. Yeah, he's got a booth in the back. Who's he with? His new chick, Isabella, some hippie-looking girl, and some weird-looking dude. Isabella? What's she doing here? How the fuck should I know? Okay. Yeah, it's always here. Hi, honey. Mm. Glad you can make it. For sure, bro. Oh, good to see you. Gee, hey, babe. Hi, Tyler. Is. I like the bullseye right between your tits. Fuck you, Tyler. <laughs> Ligori. What? Ligori. Yeah, we all heard you, bro. My name is Bagori. I mean, you greeted everybody else, so I figured I'd introduce myself. Right. Uh, sorry. How rude of me. Tyler, nice to meet you. Well, I think I'm ready for another drink. Would anyone else like to join me up at the bar? Fuck yeah. Let's get this party started. Okay, I was not talking to you. Oh, no, nah, man, I'm good. Fuck that. We haven't been out together in forever. Should we even be in here? RJ's the next cop. I come back here all the time. Don't worry about it. I shouldn't. I don't want to get too fucked up in front of Kayla. Don't be a bitch. I've known her for like three months. Yep. But things are going well. I don't want to fuck it up. Yeah, what about Is? What about Is? Your girlfriend doesn't mind, you know? And you're hanging out with my them. missing wife's sister. Okay, yeah, that. Kayla's cool. She understands. That's why we're all here tonight. You of all people know that I had a hard time with Jessica's disappearance, but I'm better now. Yeah. Isabella hasn't had such an easy time trying to close that door. That's where Gianna and Bagori come in. Who? Bagori. The guy with the two different eyes and the scar? What the fuck is that guy's deal? Why are you giving him such a hard time? Oh, Listen, on. Isabella thinks this will help her find closure, and quite frankly, it won't hurt me either. So what's that got to do with Big Gary and G? The gory. Whatever. What the fuck? Fuck <coughs> <Bust it, coughs> these motherfuckers. Oh, damn, I'm sorry. Yeah. Are you yeah, fucking yeah. kidding me? Them girls said they smell weed coming from back here and it's you motherfuckers? Are you serious, man? Sorry. This a good idea to you? Fucking disrespectful. You think that's okay? No, I'm RJ, my bad. You said you come in here all the time. <laughs> I love scary white boys. <laughs> Listen, it's cool with me. Don't let Carl bust you, okay? He's got a lot of money invested in this club. They won't think it's funny, okay? Deal.
So just a fireman husband, that's, that's it? <laughs> well, that, and I also want a princess wedding. Of course you do. Have you talked to Michael about any of this? I've always known that I'd be with the firemen. They're just so hot and manly. And what about a career? Do you have any thoughts about something like that for yourself? Well, I do some work for Victoria's Secret, and Michael's about to go back to, you know, being a fireman. So you're a model. Most people do think I'm a model, but for now I just work part-time with the mom. I'm sorry. <laughs> so. So you work at a Victoria's Secret? Because you just said you do some work for a Victoria's Secret. So I thought, well, I could do the whole modeling thing, but I don't want to take any time away from my family. Family is important. I, I will give you that. Do you come from a big family? What? <laughs> no. My parents said that one of me is enough. And I mean, why try and talk this, right? Right. Uh I mean, you, you, you did just say you didn't want to take time away from family, so I thought maybe you had... Oh, for when Michael and I get married and have kids. Two girls and two boys. Michael Jr., of course. <laughs> the white picket fence. I'm going to be um, out by the, by the table. Compliments to the house. The house special, sledgehammers and roar. Yeah, I love the Roar. Why does everybody look so serious? You guys know that Jess went missing on Clinton Road, right? Wait a minute, you guys come here to have a good time and that's the topic of discussion? Well, this guy is clairvoyant and he's gonna take Mike and Iz out there to talk to Jess and find out what happened. Fuck that, man. That place is dark, man. Everybody knows that place is haunted. Isn't it just a bunch of urban legends? Says you. You? My aunt had a house near there. I know a lot about that place. Wait, you've been there? Been there? Had a fucking experience on that road. I mean, listen, one night I'm driving. I'm by myself. It's dark. Driving down the road about two miles, and I see this lady standing in the road. She's got her thumb out. So me, I'm a nice guy. I decide I'm going to pick her up. She gets in the car. She doesn't say one single word. So we drive about three miles. And she says she wants to get out. So I stop the car. I let her out. She walks right off into the woods. That's not my problem. I'm not going to go after her or anything. But let me tell you, when she got out of that car, the hair was standing up on the back of my neck. Big hey, deal. I had you her. No, 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 no. It doesn't stop there. I drive about two more miles, and I see the same lady standing on the road with her thumb out. And it gets worse from there. I'm nervous, so I punch out. And the next thing you know, I'm back on the same road where I first started. Like, like some time shift shit. Like, I'm back. Like, I'm, I'm going in fucking circles and shit. Fuck that place, man. That shit is dark. That place is evil. Do not go there. Evil? Come on, RJ. You don't actually believe in that shit. Listen, man. Haven't you ever felt somebody was watching you? <laughs> Like they were standing over you. I mean, so close, you could feel the breath on the back of your neck. And then when you look around, nobody's there. Hey. What the fuck are you doing, man? What is so important you gotta talk to me right now? Are you crazy? You know, fuck this. You tell them. Boss, the table in the back, they don't wanna pay the check. Do you wanna die? No. Walk away. Going to Clinton Road? Yes. Cheers. 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 <laughs> Cheers. So, let me get this straight. You're some spiritual medium from Ohio, and you're gonna talk to Jess using this hocus pocus stuff in the woods off of, you know, some haunted road in Jersey and find out what happened there? Not to be condescending, but in layman's terms, yes. Michael, you're okay with this? Yeah. If it'll help Isabella and I move forward, then what can it hurt? Nobody asked your opinion, Tyler. No, but Michael's my friend 
and have a right to look out for his best interests. Tyler, you only think it's stupid because you don't understand it. No, I think it's stupid because I think you and your new boyfriend here are trying to con my boy out of some money. Oh, you're telling me your boyfriend's doing this out of the kindness of his heart? Well, it's typical for someone to get paid for services such as these. Right. Oh, oh. and now it all becomes clear. You know what, Tyler? None of this is your business anyway, but Michael's not paying for anything, okay? I am. And I invited him to come with me because we might finally find out what happened to my sister. Do you, do you get off on being an arrogant fuck? Move. Just a skeptical asshole, Tyler. And you're just some crazy hippie wannabe that's pimping out your new boyfriend for a buck. Fuck you. Guys, we're here to have fun. Just fun. RJ, the maze is here. Hey, RJ, not fucking bad for an ex cop. Congratulations, Mr. Mayor. Thank you very much. Who the fuck are you looking at? Nobody important. Oh, yeah? Hey, hey. Oh, calm down, dickhead. We're here to have a fucking good time, all right? Explain yourself. Come on. Thank you. Yeah, you're lucky you got elected. Take it easy. He's the mayor now. That shit's all in his head. It makes my heart heavy to see somebody that doesn't understand the energies of the earth. Listen, Magori, don't spit your spiritual shit no, out. I'm not finished. This process requires faith and focus, neither of which you have. And with you coming along, it jeopardizes all of that for everyone else. Are you done? You know I am. Good. And all I have to say is that I don't want my friend get his hopes up and be disappointed. He's already been through a lot, and it's my responsibility to make sure he doesn't get fucked over. Good luck. Good luck? Yeah. Good luck. Hey guys, Gregory and I are gonna get out of here. Oh, cool, we're, we're right behind you once we just pick up the bill. You don't have to get the whole thing by yourself. I mean, chip in. No, 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 no. I, I got it. Well, at least let me too. Thanks, G. Oh. I'm gonna talk to Is later. She's gonna fill you in on everything. Okay. Hi. Hi. Oh, 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 oh. Are you okay? Oh, shit, that hurt. I'm so sorry, honey. Oh. It's actually not that bad. No, it's not that bad. You're gonna need some more drinks before we go anywhere. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Hi, good evening. Dolores. Yes, all oh, these RJ's waiting for I left you on the house. Thank Have a great time. Bye bye. Dolores and guests. Eric Hi. Roberts, I'm on the list. You're not Eric Roberts. I know Eric Roberts. He's handsome. And he's taller. And he's younger. Wow. Yeah. Sorry. Yes, that. Macy? Oh, Mr. Roberts. I'm so sorry. I so, didn't what's even your realize. Name? What's your name? Cheyenne. Call me Eric. I'm so sorry. So, oh, oh, I apologize. Mr. Roberts, night. please take care of him. Why don't you uh, keep this on your ear until you get home? Well, can I stay with you tonight, babe? Of course. Let me, uh, let me just get us a cab. Okay. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm good. Let's just get home. I got you some water. Thanks, babe. Of course. How are you feeling? Okay. <laughs> Actually, it doesn't look that bad. Really? If you're okay, I'm gonna get a little work done at the desk before we go to bed. Okay, I'm gonna grab a shower.
Hey, babe. Jesus. Babe, I thought you were taking a shower. I was thinking that I wasn't quite dirty enough to need a shower just yet. I was just, uh... This is it. This is the last place anyone saw Jess. I love getting out of the city. It's so freeing. Yeah. Great outdoors. <laughs> All right, so um, what happens now, Jim? Uh, now we find Bogori. Okay. Well, I hope you didn't pay this ghost whisperer, because it looks like he's a no-show. Knowing him, he probably walked here. Actually, he's right there, leaning up against the tree. Is he walking to that tree? Didn't think we came out here to talk to trees. Right. Gee, I just um, I want to say thank you for setting this whole thing up. I really appreciate it. Oh, girl, anything for you. Well, that and I love watching him do his voodoo shit. It's so hot. What? It gets all serious and sweaty. Oh God, you please tell me this isn't going to turn into some weird drug and piece of it. No, thing. babe. He's a legit witch doctor. I wouldn't do this if I wasn't like 60% sure he could do it. I mean, we might go fuck at the woods after, but it's all business first. It's very reassuring. You actually have done this before, right? Do you, you mean contact the spirit? Yeah. Yeah, we contacted my dead granny. Really? Yeah. It was amazing. How did you know it was actually her? It, it was her. Trust me. He's amazing. Okay? It'll be good. Here. Really? Right here? The fire goes here. Isn't a fire gonna piss off all these trees? <laughs> oh, come on, babe. I'm sorry, but that was funny as shit. You know what? This is actually sort of serious for some of us. So if you two are gonna keep making jokes and fucking around, then why don't you just go sit in the truck together? I thought it was a pretty legitimate question. It's not. All right, fine. Shut up. Shit. What's wrong? My phone. I think I left it in the car. Babe, can you go get it for me? Yeah, sure. Keys. Babe, will you get my phone? Sure. <sighs> Holy shit, you scared the fuck out of me. It wasn't my intention. <sighs> How may I help you? Are we okay to park here? There's absolutely no camping in this area. That's good. We're not camping. No fires. Understood. Most importantly, stick to the road. Yeah. Yeah, it's just me and some friends, you know, hiking. No camping, no fires. Stick to the road. The road? What 
the fuck? Keys. Not the best time for selfies, hon. Yeah, babe, come on. Whatever. There's no reception here anyway. Is this, is this normal, G? Gianna, is this normal? Gianna! Huh? Is he okay? Should we do something? I don't know. What's he say? It sounds like French. I don't speak French. Baby, are you okay? Baby? By any signal, we can use Google Translate. Hashtag fucked up shit in the woods. Kayla, what the hell? Seriously? Put your goddamn phone away and show some respect! Kayla. I'm sorry. Kayla. You can't just go walking off. Hey, stay here, bro. Take care of this shit. Kayla, hold up. Damn it. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Michael, we don't know that, okay? We just we need to be patient, right? Maybe something is going to happen. I gotta get some air. Michael. Michael, come on. Gee, you got this? I'm good, bro. Michael! Kayla, be careful. Kayla, hold on. Just relax. He didn't mean that. Yeah, he did. Such an asshole sometimes. No, he's, he's really stressed right now. Oh, yeah? Well, I came all the way out here for him, so he should be showing a little more appreciation, don't you think? Yes, I agree. Listen, I got a lot of respect for you coming all the way out here. So nice. Michael's lucky to have a friend like you. Any friend of Michael's is a friend of mine, too. I have something to admit. What's that? I didn't come out here to support Michael in the search for his missing wife. No? Why'd you come? Selfish reasons. There's nothing I could think of less selfish than helping someone find closure. Yeah, it's that. But... But what? It's nothing. Um, I'm just being stupid. Come on. I thought... What if... I mean... 
What if he found her? She's been missing a while. If she hasn't turned up by now, I really don't think she's going to. Okay. What about Isabella? Yes? What about her? I don't know. They're close. Really? You think Michael came all the way out here to hook up with his missing wife or her sister? It's stupid and selfish. I told you. Look, Michael likes you. He's with you and he's loyal. You have nothing to worry about. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Am I totally insane for bringing us out into the middle of the woods for this? No. It's a beautiful sentiment. I'm not sure that Bagori is the right man for the job. Are you shitting me? We have a dude back there who's convulsing on the ground and speaking in tongues. Do you know of a better guy for the job? <sighs> it's good to laugh with you. I'm glad you're still in my life, Michael. You, you are still an awesome brother-in-law. And you're a neurotic workaholic with crazy ideas. Okay, you can just... <laughs> Did you hear that? Looks like an old fireplace. It's actually an, a foundry. Like for a smith? Yeah, I mean, I guess so, but it, it doesn't look like it's been used in like a uh, hundred or two hundred years. Okay, I am ready to get back now. Michael. Yeah, I'm gonna step ahead of you. I saw a mechanic, his daughter, this iron worker, like a boy in, a, boy in the water. What are you talking about, baby? Pierced evil. I know it's been wrongfully killed and then tricked. Who? They were tricked. These people, they were tricked into thinking that the only way they'd be able to pass on is by collecting the souls of the dams. It wasn't making any sense. Fuck! This place is fucking so evil. They're not gonna let us leave here. We gotta get out of here. Then let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. I just, I just want to go. I just want to leave. I just want to get the fuck out of here. I can't go yet. Where the fuck is my satchel? What the fuck is that? What? I don't know. It's like something dropping into the water. You don't hear that? There. Did you see that? It's like a little pebble or something falling off the bridge. Maybe someone's fishing from the bridge. I don't know. Let's go check that out. Are you sure this is the way that we came? I thought so. It's, it's just dark. It's hard to tell. It, it just, it feels like we've been walking far enough now that we should be back already. Totally. Uh, I, mean, it's, I just can't see anything. We must have got turned around. Okay, let's just let's make sure we're going the right way. And not that way. Agreed. <laughs> hey, look. What's that? Headlights. If there's a car, there's a road. I vote we go that way. Agreed.
the fuck? Check this out. Coins. It's weird. Oh, that must have been what was splashing into the water. Yeah, but how? They're just sitting. The wind? It's definitely what I heard. See anything over there? A squirrel. A what? A squirrel. One of those little fuzzy tree rats. I know what a squirrel is. Oh, uh -huh. maybe a squirrel came running across the bridge and was not. What was that? Holy shit! There's a kid in the water! Oh my, oh my god, Tyler, hurry! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Kayla! Where's the kid? He's right there! Where? He's right there! Kayla, where? Tyler, he's right there! Hurry, he's gonna drown! Kayla, where? Hold on. Michael, there, there's absolutely no way that those lights were this far off. I was just thinking the same thing. Oh my God, how could we possibly have missed the road? I don't know. I, it was a car or truck lights. I just don't understand how they drove shh, through shh, here. But... Shh. What? Listen. Is that a... I mean, it sounds like the crackling of a fire, right? I think it's coming from over there. That has to be them. Right? Come on. Okay. Baby, can we just leave? I want to get out of here. Oh, I, I have to figure this out. Oh, shit. Jonna? Jonna! What? Where, where are my notes? I don't know. They're, they're in your bag. No, no, no. They were in the car. I said, put them in my bag. Could you have left them in the car? Maybe. I don't know. Fuck! You're going to have to go get them. You want me to go out there alone? I can't leave here. I need them to cleanse this place. Cleanse ourselves. It's the only way we're going to get out of here. I, I just, I feel like we are walking in circles. I mean, we should have come across like a trail or the road or just anything by now. I don't know. I mean, maybe, maybe we should be going towards the clanging. Maybe that's part of Bergori's thing. Oh, this is bullshit. I just... Wait, 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 wait. Do you smell that? Smoke. Okay. Just wait there. All right. Let's get to the others and get the hell out of here.
Show yourselves. Show yourselves. Show yourselves. Show yourselves. I'm sorry that I dragged us out here. No, it's fine. Let's just not do it again. Let's chalk it up and move on. Agreed. What? How could we... There's a little girl. Sweetheart. Sweetheart, do you live around here? Sweetheart, we're a little lost. And we're trying to find our friends and get back to our car. And we just are looking for someone to help us. Do you know where your parents are? Go, 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 go. Come on, come on. We're gonna get out of here. Michael, where? We're just we're just running around in circles. We are completely lost. No, we're not. Look, it's a bridge. The ranger said stick to the road. What? We got this. It's like 50 steps and we're there. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wait. What? What is it? Looks like Tyler's shorts. Tyler! Tyler! Die! Tyler! 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 Oh! Michael! Oh, fuck! Are you okay? What just happened? Oh, something grabbed me. What? what? What do you mean something grabbed you? What do know. you mean? I don't know. Let's get out of here before we find out what. Oh. Come on. Oh. Are you okay? Are you okay? Okay. 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 Ok
Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh Oh fuck! Okay! Mmm! Mmm, check this! Got it! Come on! Okay. Okay, just watch out. Okay. I can't go any further. Hold on. Oh, oh it really hurts. Let me look. Come here. Okay. Let me take a look. Come on. Oh my God. It's bad. Okay. You really think? Oh, fuck. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, I want to go home. I want to go home. I know. Me too. Let's just... Let's get to the others and get the fuck out of here. We never crossed a bridge. So, Tyler's truck has got to be that way. I am not going back into the woods, Michael. I understand. Walk right down this road. It's gotta go to the other road. The main road. And once we, once we get to the others, we'll figure it out from there, okay? Okay. 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 Help me up. We got this. Come on. Stop, do you hear that? What? What is that? It sounds like a little girl. It's a trick. Ignore her. Get no, walking. it's not, Michael. I can hear her. She's not real. Keep walking. Come on. Woman, go to the vehicle. Get my things. How the fuck dare you talk to me like that? Fuck, am I supposed to get into the truck without any keys? Asshole. Magori? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> 
Is dead? Are you yes, sure? Yes, we need to run. We need to get the fuck out of here. Okay, okay. All right, we're together. Okay, we're together now. Michael, we need to go. Yeah, we're, we're going. Where's Caitlin Tyler? I don't know. We haven't we haven't seen him. We um, we think they found Tyler short in the river down by the bridge. The bridge? Well, what bridge? There's a bridge that way. But Begori was saying something about a, a boy and, and a bridge and a man and, and a truck, and he wasn't making any sense, but. I'm not going to murder any fucking bridge. Well, we're not going back to the bridge either, don't worry. We're just going to stick near the truck and wait for somebody to drive by. Well, why are we going to wait? Why don't we just leave? No keys. Listen, they know we're here. Who knows we're here? When, when I came to get Kayla's phone, a forest ranger came and he, he, was, he was suspicious about us camping in the woods. I'm sure he's going to come back and make sure that we aren't. Oh my God. We're as good as out of here. <laughs> hey! Help! Hey! Help! Hey! Help! Help! He's not stopping. Help. Hey! Oh, shit! Help. Help. What the f the fuck? Yeah, you? Diana! I'm okay! Okay, hey! What the fuck was that? No, 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 no! No, no, no! Come back! Come back! No, 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 no! We need to get help! We don't we know what that help, is. Dear. No, no, no. We need to get help. We don't How know what that is. We need to get help, Michael. I'm gonna walk out of here. Straight down this fucking road. Come on. We're gonna get you straight to a hospital, okay, Michael? Maybe you're to a priest, too. <laughs> don't! 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 I'm done running. Come on. We have to keep going. to be close to someone. Come on. <sighs> Michael. <sighs> Finally. Come on. We're gonna go get some help and then we're gonna go back. We're gonna get our Gianna, okay? 
Okay, come on. I'm almost there. Oh, I'm shit. I'm almost there. Oh. I'm almost there. Hello? 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 Is there anyone there? Come on, come on. Who leaves the door open? Hello? Is there anybody there? Please, we need help. Can we come in, please? Please? Michael, please, I can't. Anywhere is fucking better than out there. I, I can't be in the woods anymore. I can't be on that road anymore, okay? Look, we, this is a good place. We, we'll just get you off your foot and, and we'll check it out and we'll just wait. We'll wait until the morning, until the sun comes up, and then we'll go back out to the road and wait for someone to come, okay? Just go inside, right. okay? Please. It wouldn't, it wouldn't hurt to get off your foot. Okay. Come on. Come on. Oh. a little bit farther. All right, we're gonna get you sat down and comfortable. Okay? Oh, take this off, take this off. Go, go. You got it. Look. There's a fire. Somebody must be here. Hello? Hello? Oh, come on, come on. Get you right here. Okay. I'll take your time. Take some. I got it. Okay. Are you okay? Oh, I'm good. Hello? Isabella. Jess? Jess, is that you? Jessica? Jessica? Jess. 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 Jess.
That's Kayla. Help! Yes! Kayla! Help! Help somebody! Help! Is anybody around? Fuck! Kayla! Michael? Kayla! Kayla, it's me, babe!
Just, just, just. Just. This is it, babe. Stick to the fuck! Get the fuck, get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Holy shit! Oh my god! What was wrong with that guy? Just, don't worry, baby. He's just oh drunk, drunk on the road. He's scared the piss out of me. What was he even saying? Just some drunk gibberish. Uh, that's too much tequila, I guess. <laughs> yes. You trying to scare the panties off of me? I um didn't think you were wearing any. <laughs> Maybe I'm not. Hmm. Well, surprise, surprise. <laughs> I did scare the panties off you, huh? <laughs> Oh my god, there's a, there's a little girl outside. What? Wait, I don't see anything. I swear she was right there looking right in here. Oh, creepy looking little girl. Babe, babe, we're miles away from the closest home. There is no way there's a kid on this road. I know what I saw. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check it out. No, don't go out there. Please. I'll, I'll, I'll go. No, John, stay here. Ugh. No, don't go out there. Babe, seriously? Look at me. I'm pretty sure the kid sees me. I'm gonna scare him off. Okay? Girl, riding on a horse, hella golden smile, Daisy Duke and shorts. Yet I'm a city boy that be rocking bands, known to be making the money any way I can. We don't go hand in hand, but we're holding them. It's a mutual connection, we just understand. Slow and steady till it's finally our wedding. Couldn't imagine any other way it be heading. Never asking me questions about my past records. Getting closer to heaven, cause she done gave a blessing. Fire, water, Jack creation. Give thanks and praise to the Almighty One. She bless me with a daughter, bless me with a son, bless me with a feeling good meditation. Keep on. 
Something about women Talking about the realest who ain't scared to handle business Y'all deserve the children with the white picket fences Waking up to breakfast, honey butter biscuits She found out about the bounty amount I reckon that she still wouldn't tattle a shout All she wants is marriage, doggy with the carriage Gold till we're old and eventually perish Even though I know she's the daughter of the sheriff Guess that I do much as I don't for his caring Fire, water, Jack creation Give thanks and praise to the almighty one She bless me with her daughter, bless me with her son Bless me with her feeling good meditation I keep my thoughts to myself He don't understand Time.